hisia zako zisiwe kubwa kuliko ufunuo wa Mungu ndani yako. Mungu anaweza akakupa ufunuo juu ya mahali fulani au juu ya mtu fulani. Na kwa sababu tu ya maumivu ya hisia yakakufanya ufunuo wako ukazimwa. Please let your revelation be bigger than your pain. Let your revelation speak louder than your pain. Some of you here mmeingia kwenye mahusiano because maybe God told you something. Kuna ufunuo Mungu amekupa juu ya mtu, juu ya mpenzi wako, juu ya mkeo, juu ya meo, juu ya bebi wako au juu ya huyo partner wako wa biashara. And then along the way kuna maumivu anakuletea au amekuletea au anakuletea. And then when your pain becomes bigger than your revelation, you are missing out. Because according to God, Mungu anaangalia purpose of your union than whatever that is going through now. Be very careful. Uwe makini. Unapomwambia mtu Mungu amekuambia au unaposema hivi Mungu ameniambia, ushauri kuoneza hivi Mungu ameniambia huyu ni mke wangu. Unamuoa, unamwambia kabisa na mchungaji wako, baba mchungaji huyu Mungu ameniambia. Unakoma na mchungaji anasema, "Eh wala, hamna noma. Bwana na akubareke." Bwana na akuwati. Akubareke. Mchungaji bila pressure anawafungisha ndoa. Mnaingia kwenye harusi. Haleluya. Mnapata katoto ka kwanza, katoto ka pili. Mambo yanatokea unasema hivi ndio huyu maumivu anayokuletea huamini macho yako wala masikio yako wala pua yako huamini chochote ghafla tunakukuta barabarani very well divorced tunakuuliza swali vipi ah yule ni mbwa mbwa yule see this is the reason why watoto wa Mungu wengi maisha yao hatima zao wazitimii mandoto makubwa walionayo yanaishia hewani wakati mwingine mapito yanaruhusiwa kwenye maisha yetu Mungu anatupima how strong my voice is in your heart yes can you really still obey me even in the midst of your pain yes Mungu alipoambia wana waize watoke misi waende nchi ya Kanani njia aliyowapitisha alijua ina bahari ndani ila alinyamaza kimya kuelezea bahari walipofika kwenye bahari kikwazo kimetokea za he Musa Umetuleta huko tufe baba turudishe but you know what god knew i wanted to see even in the midst of the sea blockage bado mtasema kwamba mungu neither nilituambia we know there is a way unafahamu mmefika baharini pale hamuoni njia lakini sasa hivi mungu wewe sio mjinga ulipotuambia tupite hii njia there is a way you had the way yes it is impossible kukosa njia that's why moses is crying Anamlilia Mungu za Mungu eh hey, Mungu anambia no waambie waendelee mbele wapitie njia ipi baba Hafu hajamwambia waambie wapitie kulia au wapite kusha waendelee mbele Nini Hapo hapo mnaposema hamna njia <laughs> mbingu inaiona njia Amen Angalia wengine mlivyolaani biashara zenu Mnasema kwa hii idea Mungu amenipa unalizia washoga zako wa fellowship yani wapenzi wa mama Kitumbwe yani Mungu amenipa wazo kubwa Chiku akuta wapendwa anaelezea mawazo yao Nasikia Mungu akanisemesha Mungu akaniambia Mungu akanielekeza Mungu jamani muende pale pale na huyu Mungu Mungu abadilishi alichokuambia kwa sababu eti mazingira yamebadilika Yes His word remains intact mtaikuta bahari mbele my word still says mtapita sisi ndio tunabadilisha mambo Mungu aliyotuambia eti kwa sababu mazingira